We're now going to do a moulded weldable stop end and the only difference between a moulded weldable and a standard is the liner only needs to come to the end of the gutter. The liner needs to be fixed so we need to pin the liner Once the line is pinned in place, we can then place the stop end in and we can weld that into position. Key to welding the stop end is knowing the weak points, which is always in the crease on the base. So they have to be as tight as you can when you weld either side. We get our stop end into position, ready for welding. Get your angle blank, fix that using the correct fixings with the washer on. Again, one either side. We're now ready to weld the stop end into place. Then come to the other side and do exactly the same. Push the heat gun into the crease. Use your fingers pushing the material tight into the crease. Use your penny roller, a little bit of heat and just a little roll. Always allow the material to cool before your probe test. It's normally recommended to do all your welds through the day and then go back over every unit. Drag your probe around. If it does lift up anywhere, just put the heat gun in and re-roll it.